In this video, we want to make it so that we can click on an image or a photo and it's going to take us to the details page where it'll show us a bigger version of the image and also the fields. So let's start with going to the controller, photo controller, and we have the details, uh, details method at the bottom here. We're passing in the ID, which is coming from the URL. So we want to get that photo. Okay, so let's say photo equals db table, and we can pass in this table where the ID is equal to the passed in ID, and we want to get the first. Okay, then after that, we just want to render the template. So we'll say return view and let's pass in photo details. And we also want to pass in, let's say, compact photo. Okay, now let's go to our views folder and then photo details.blade.php. Okay, and let's just copy from this all right we'll change the photo title is going to go in the h1 and the description will go here and then let's get rid of all this stuff all right so in the h1 photo title here we'll have photo description oops all right so let's see if that works so far oh you know what we have to create a route that's right so let's go to routes and I'm going to copy this. This is going to be photo details. And then photo controller at details. Okay, so now if we click on this. It takes us to the details view. We're getting the title. We're getting the... Uh, description. So back to the details view. Uh, let's also put the location underneath. All right. And then for the image. That's going to go down here. Um, let's say image. We're going to give it a class of main image. And then the source slash images slash. And then we want photo image. Just like that. Okay, so there's our photo. Now I just want to add in a tiny bit of CSS. So if we go to public CSS app CSS, let's say main image display as a block, and we'll set the width to 60%, margin auto, that'll push it to the middle. And let's say padding 30 pixels. And there we go. There's our image. Let's have a, um, a link here to go back to the gallery. Okay, we'll put this right above the H1.
Okay, so that's going to go to slash gallery slash show, and then we need the ID. So that's going to be photo gallery ID. Awesome. So if we go back to galleries, let's click on the Pepsi, or I'm, I'm sorry, the logos. Click on that. It gives us the big version. So our photo gallery is essentially done. Um, but what I do want to do is I want to uh, implement a login and a registration. All right, so we'll get to that next.